HitMaker's device types capability lets you easily create USB HID source code in minutes for several different kinds of projects without first having to spend months studying USB protocols. This video is brought to you by Trace Systems Inc., the makers of HitMaker and Simple Upgrade Management System. Download our free guide to USB success, Secrets of Successful USB Developers. On the opening page of the HitMaker Wizard, you'll see a set of big buttons. These buttons let you choose the kind of device and data that is best for the particular design problem you need to solve right now. Some projects only need a single channel of data, usually because the device only has to do one thing. For a project like that, we could click on the normal button on the left. When we do, a matching explanation appears on the left. If you commit to the normal device for your current project, then on a later page, HitMaker will show you only a single USB configuration containing only a single USB interface for your data. But some design projects have more complicated requirements. Maybe they need several channels of data, or they have several different types of functionality to control. Then we would click on the Composite Device Type button, which has a single USB configuration containing multiple USB interfaces. Still other design projects may have even more complex requirements, like maybe having a factory test capability, or maybe they need to be able to change their behavior and even their data while the device is running to adapt to changing conditions. For devices like that, we would click the Soft Detach Device Type button. A HitMaker's Soft Detach Device Type has two USB configurations, which operate at different times, and which can be switched by a signal from the generated HitMaker PC program. Each configuration can have similar or completely different USB data than the other one. We like to call these configurations identities. A HitMaker soft detach device is the easiest way to make devices that can change their nature and the data they communicate on the fly, at your command. You only commit to using one of these device types when you select its big button and then click the next button of the wizard to go to the next page of the HitMaker wizard. Every HitMaker project you make can use one of these device types. These device type buttons let you quickly and easily choose the right kind of device to solve the unique design problem for each HitMaker project you create. They give you enormous power at the click of a button. Question of the day. How could you make use of multiple data channels in a control or monitoring project? Thanks for checking out this video. Please subscribe if you're not already subscribed. If you want to, check out that free Secrets of Successful USB Developers Guide with tips on getting your USB projects working end-to-end -end really fast every single time. Click or tap the screen in the description below. As always, we're helping you build your knowledge, skills, and impact with online video. Talk to you soon.